A News 2 I-Team investigation. Some believe it could be the next big industry here in South Carolina and a big job creator. Starting this week, farmers can apply to grow hemp. News 2's investigator Rebecca Collette explains who could benefit. Good evening. Here's why growing hemp matters to all of us and not just farmers. As farmers grow the product, legislators expect business to locate in rural places like where I am in Dorchester County to help process it for all of its many uses, thus creating lots of jobs. It's not the kind of plant you light up and smoke. Recreational marijuana and industrial hemp. They are what I would call very distant cousins, third or fourth cousins. Hemp won't necessarily get you high, but growing it could be a boost to the economy. We've got buyers beyond the borders waiting to come to South Carolina to invest in our farmers. Representative Wendell Gilliard says they bring with them jobs processing hemp, which is used in everything from sailboat ropes and clothes to biofuel. Already a Lake City processor is starting a renovation on a building in anticipation of the first growth season in spring 2018. Agricultural leaders are hopeful hemp plants will be just as profitable as tobacco once was. Farmers are looking for an opportunity to rebound and to diversify uh, because of very low prices of the traditional row crops. After this first year of 20 farmers on 20 acres each, the program doubles next year to 40 farmers on 40 acres each. In Dorchester County tonight, I'm Rebecca Collette for the News 2. And farmers can apply beginning tomorrow. And if you'd like more information on applying and on the uses of hemp, go to our website, countonto.com.